Meanwhile, Taipei has begun work on its first public housing reconstruction project since Mayor Ke Wenzhe took office. The city will tear down and rebuild Nangang's Taipei public housing complex, which had been plagued by leaks and other problems. The excavator began work on tearing down this five-story building on orders from the Taipei deputy mayor. This is the Taipei public housing complex in Nangan district. For years, residents have endured leaks and other problems. For this reason, Ko Wenjit made it the first public housing complex to be torn down since becoming mayor. New homes won't leak. Isn't that a good thing? In the future, residents won't always have to bother me about leaks. These issues can frustrate neighborhood chiefs, too. The complex will be rebuilt as the Dongming public housing complex. The number of units will be increased from 219 to 760. They will be rented out at a 30 percent discount compared to market value. Deputy Mayor Charles Lin says Dongming will become a model intelligent community. Taipei is doing everything it can to promote intelligent communities. We'll begin with public housing communities. You will be able to drink tap water directly without boiling it, which will save water and energy. Homes will also have smart electric and gas meters. Lin said that Ko plans to build 25,000 public housing units during his first four years in office. The city is cooperating with technology firms on the Doming project. If the partnership proves beneficial, new ideas from the firms will be incorporated into other projects.